Track's looking good for Tab Turnbull Stakes Day. Friday morning we're currently at good four and the running rail's in the nine metre position. So really happy with where we sit 24 hours out from the big day and um, I'd expect the track to play well. It's been great to see some sunshine this week. Uh, we had some dry days early in the week, followed up with some rainfall across Tuesday, Wednesday, and then we've been dry since then. So the rainfall's really brought the track right on and we actually need some midweek. So um, looking in really good condition for tomorrow. With the straight racing, I think the two-year-olds will come down to the inside part of the course. Quite often the young horses like to have a guide with the running rail, so I'd expect those to roll down to the fence. And for the other two straight races, I'd, I'd expect the horses to use that middle to outside part of the course as per the normal pattern for straight racing. So we'll try to keep the track exactly where it is leading into Carnival. We want to make sure that we're in that good four range to kick off the day and make sure that there's some give in the track for all the horses. And naturally with the warmer weather this time of year, the track does dry out. So we'll aim for that good four upgrade to a good three uh, track for all the meetings throughout the spring. And that tends to suit the majority of horses. So fingers crossed the weather can stay fine and, and we can have a bit of luck along the way. I think for the Turnbull Stakes they'll use plenty of the track. We've got a full field so um, a little bit later on in the day so they should see a good tempo and that'll allow horses to run and give, give every horse a chance um, which is going to be a great race during the day. After this race meeting we'll remove the running rail, put it down in the true position and then mow the track down so we can really thicken up the grass cover and get it re ready for what's a big cup week. So we'll verti drain the track next week, apply a fertiliser, mow the track down and, and really thicken up the grass cover so it's in tip top condition for Derby Day.